today I'm going to show you what I use to soft contour. The Kat Von D Shade to Light Contour. I've been using this for maybe about mm, a year, maybe. Did you know that you can punch them out? You get something in there. Like if you have another palette, you can take these out and put it into whoa, you can take these out and put it into another case. Ah, dusty. So, I'm going to show you how to contour, a soft contour, really quick, on the go, soft contour. So right now I have my face done, as you watched in the speedy beginning. Um, I'm going to take a brush like this, which I've used already, so it's a little brown. So like this, like so. Yeah, you're gonna take, so if your face, ooh, if your face is like this color, you don't wanna go too dark. So this would be too dark, but if you wanna get chiseled in depth, yeah, I would say yeah. But right now, I'm not going anywhere and it's daylight outside. I'm gonna do this. And I would picture a skeleton. If you picture a skeleton, you see how its jaw is, is, is very um, chiseled. So imagine yours as a, a skeleton. Let me adjust my mirror real quick. So I'm going to try to cover... See that? In due time. Right there. That's where I want my jawline. You're just going to take maybe... Well, if you're not good, if you're gonna try it out for for the first time, do a like a shade or two shades darker than your foundation. If you're using powder, you don't want to do it too extreme because then when people see you from the side view and you see like this slash, they're gonna know. And makeup is mm, you gotta blend it in. I I say you gotta blend. I say I say. I say you gotta blend in the makeup well into your foundation. Foundation. <laughs> what in the hell? I'm a little congested, as you can hear. I drank all I could, girl. I drank this this morning, this in the afternoon. I'm on Muse next out, and I did a decongestion of something else. It's just not. It's making me really sleepy. So yeah, um, let's get back to that. Let's chisel, like I went like this, to lay out the color. So, look at this. What? Compared to this. You can still see it, right? Mm-hmm. Let's do it to this side. Or maybe the lighting. I got like some kind of natural, look at that, face fat, okay. I don't know where this came from. It's like Halloween hit and, and it went straight to my neck. <laughs> okay, do like so. So there's a jawline here, you can go deeper, like if you're going to a party or something and you want to chisel that out, go deeper. You can do deeper right here, but like I said, blend it out. Because if you do not blend it out, you will look like something else. You have girls looking at you from across. You'll have girls looking at you from across the room like, ooh, look at her. She got a cakey ass face and she doesn't even know how to blend that shit. You've done it. You know you have. Am I crooked? Lean it down a little bit. Look at my forehead. Lean it back a little bit. Boom. Okay. Mom, 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 mom. It's okay. <sighs> so, yeah. A little shadow, right? I'm skinny. I'm skinny again. So you see this? This is, I don't know why. That's like a natural thing in my face. But that's where you would put the 
other color. Or no, the same color, I'm sorry. You would put it right there to chisel out this. You see that fat? Eater, eater. Mm-hmm. Blend, baby, blend. Mm -hmm. If you do, I'll do another video with a, a stick foundation, but this is soft contour of your double chin. Mm. Girls, y'all need this because I need it. If I need it, I know someone else wants to cover this baby up. <sighs> you could, I think I have, like, I, I also use Kat Von D. Lock it. I'm in, uh, my color is tan. Tan 170. Dusty. Dusty as shit. Mm -mm -mm. Lightly. Lightly. You can pull your foundation down your neck, down to your decollete, just so you could you have something to blend it with. You know, like if you blend your eyeshadow, you have layers. One layer is your base. You put something on top of that, which would be your crease. That's how it, it becomes like that. You know what I mean? Oh, I thought that was like an eye brush. Mm hmm. Okay. What well, I will do for you, I will use, don't be scared of the dark one. I'm going to use the dark one for right underneath. Damn, girl. Mm. Right there. Soft contour. Did I do this side already? Freak. Okay. Mm -mm -mm. You see that? I darkened up that whole wall right there. Okay, and this, I'm running really late today. I still have to dry my hair and go, go, go. So how do I look from the beginning of the video to now? And then some people have like a really bigger forehead, but I, well, I think my forehead's shrinking, but you could put contouring here by the hairline so it doesn't look too light. So my example is the skeleton. Think of your face as a skeleton. The hollows in the cheek, maybe. I will find what picture and I will put it right here. Picture a skeleton, like so. You have the bony parts of your skin. This would be your cheekbones. So where the hollow is, is where the deep parts go. So that makes sense. The hollows of your face is where the shade of the contour ring go. And any points of your face that stick out, tip of the toe, tip of the toes, tip of the nose, here on your forehead, like, or right here, and right here, your cheekbones, anything that's pronounced, you put a highlight, not too much, Girls be taking it a little too far. But the the points that go up like a mountain are where your highlights need to go. Where it has no bone and it's hollow, shading goes in here. Okay? And if you want a chiseled nose, watch this, okay? I did a video on an, my nose contour. I don't have a good brush right now, but I'll use something like this. Do, 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 do. I will chisel my nose real quick. I think I'm gonna use that same color I used for my soft contour, but look at girl. That will disappear soon. It is hot outside, so ooh, no one told me that something on my nose. So I dip this into that same color. And you contour your nose, leaving it. There you go. Contour straight line under shade here. You want this to look deeper. Please. If I use a stick foundation, it would look a little um, more. 
if I use a stick foundation, it would look more, what is the word? It would look more defined. I think I might do that with my cream so you can see. But I'm doing my nose and you want this part to look deep so it looks like you got a bridge. Makeup is an illusion. Wipe your girl's face off. You will see the difference. Have you seen those um, transformation ones on YouTube where the girls like rip off their nose? There's like clay eyelashes. Their cheeks come off. It's makeup is magic. I'm saying. I am saying. Look at that. Makeup, 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 makeup. Oh, so there's a part where you could just do a little bit right here so it looks like, you know those noses, mine don't do it, but the noses do this, it comes out a little bit, so cute. But you could look like you have a little one so it doesn't look too fat on the end. Hmm? This is not even supposed to be part of this video. But that line is supposed to go right above the fat part of your nose. Whoop! A light contour here. And here, to make it look like it's um in there. Like swimwear, you know? My dog is doing something funny. That was weird, my camera died. Um, let me wrap it up. Uh, it says it's too hot. Why is my camera too hot? been on too long that was weird okay so this is the contour let me grab a let me grab a a blush I'm using the same brush because God don't care she in a rush <laughs> soft contour on the go <sighs> I was gonna pick up my phone and just report from there but mm. okay could you tell the difference? I have a jawline. Peace. Cheese. So soft contour, powdered foundation, defined contour for, for like nighttime and photos. I would use a stick foundation just because I'm going to do a slow turn. Ready? And the dust may appear. Dust again. So if you like this video, because you're on the go and you want to do contour real fast, um, please like, comment on the bottom, subscribe to me if you want to see more of me. I do adventures, bike rides, makeup. <laughs> that was so corny. Dun, 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 dun. All right, guys, that's it for this video. Bink, oh, bink, bink. All done. Um, if you'd like this video and want me to do a stick foundation or a cream foundation to have it more defined, please do. Yes, please let me know because I would love to know what you want to see. And if I got time, I will make time to do that video for you. And with that dust, like, share, and subscribe. This is your girl, Ivy B. Miss Ivy B, better known as Birdie Bird, is out. Catch me on another adventure. That will be my next. Thanks. Bye-bye. Hello, everybody! <laughs> oh, did you see that? <sighs> Shh! Today I'm going to show you how to... How to blah, 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 blah. Oh, sorry. Um, a soft contour. Okay, I'm not talking about chiseled out. Keep on watching. For those on the go, on the go. Those on the go. In the go, on the go. You guys want a soft contour? Please on, please on, keep on watching. I think it's because I didn't eat nothing today. I am stuttering like a mother.
Alright, bye. And...